<sighs> Greetings and salutations. This is Evelyn Romani, Lady of the Realm. Uh, back with an Eve's vocab, where I give you five words. This week, you get a bonus, by the way. <laughs> Just to run a surprise. Yes. Where I basically tell you the meaning of a word and put it in the form of a sentence. To those who are new, well, there you go. So, listen up. I'm trying to make the make the vocabulary in our society a lot better. Okay, first word. Bolus. Bolus. The meaning of it is spelled B O L U S. Bolus. And no, it's not bullocks, my good children. Bullocks. It basically means a moistened bit of food that is ready for swallowing. So, basically, you would say, swallow that bullocks. I wouldn't suggest saying it to your parents, but then again, just using a word that they don't know is funny. But yeah, you can use it as a cuss word, I guess. It's not really a cuss word, so let's try not to make it into one. However, it will just be fun anyways. Anyways, the next word is... And if you are a follower of Undertaker Freak, you already probably heard this word. It's concubiscence. Having a sexual desire. So, I, I use this in a sentence. Basically, when I told the guy to back off, I received a concupiscent response. Okay, next word, and this one was really hard, but you probably already used it, or your parents have used it on you. So, here you go. It's semantics. The understanding of word meaning and I've heard it used this way. It's probably not the it's probably not congruent, but you probably heard it this way. Anyways, it says let's not argue over semantics. Yeah, that's the best way I can explain it. I will try to see if I can find out what other phrases it can be. Oh yeah. Illusion just, just revealed. You now know, you now see no words, but... Mm-hmm, like you might see it all, huh? Okay. You can also do the study of meaning. Uh-huh. Uh, find the word way it can be used in regular English. So it's kind of a weird word. Try to use. Um Yeah, it's just branch of it can be a branch it's also a branch of ling linguistics. Basically study of languages. Anyways. On to the fourth word, and it's palatate, palate, palate, soothe or relieve, and it was in quote, well not quotation, parentheses, pain. She and I added the so uh, you have to excuse that. It's she palliated. Her emotional pain hey, by listening to music. Getting a little goth or scene kid in here, aren't we? Hmm? Yep. <laughs> okay, next word, and I apologize if I don't pronounce it. Correctly, so I'll spell it out. So, S O P H I S T R. 
or why, the art or process of reasoning or logic. And I believe it's so history, so history, so history, so history. Basically, then the sentence I said choose for this one is he won the argument with his great understanding of sophistry. Let me look that word up because I really hate how I pronounce it. And this is coming from dictionary.com, so. Sophistry. 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 Okay. Sophistry. I'm sorry. Sophistry. And, okay. Now, this one is your bonus word of the week. And you probably already heard this word if you're a smart person. Or you probably use this word towards other people that you don't like. Or you've heard it num numerous times in television when there's a renaissance fair going on. <laughs> and it's called... And the word is geek, spelled G-E-K. It's a carnival performer who bites off the heads of live chickens. They also do animals, and you can also use this word towards someone who's uh, socially inept, weird, or, you know, smart, basically a nerd or something. Let's see... Good example of both of these nice definitions. And the reason why I choose this word was basically I don't hear it anymore and I would love to hear it again. Anyways, it's when we went to the circus last week, we saw a geek. And that's wrong. And for those who have seen Smurfs, the Smurfs, or just Smurfs, I think that's the title. Character, and I was a big fan of that movie. Anyways, they have a character in there by the name of Smarty Smurf. Right. No, Brainy, I'm sorry. Brainy Smurf. Sorry, Brainy. Anyways, Brainy Smurf is a geek. He is. Can't help it. He is. Anyways, please write those down and follow me on my, I, follow me on all my social, uh, I, social media, uh, down in the description below, and, uh, please, if you like this video, click subscribe, please, please subscribe to me, and like this video, and, Follow me on my Tumblr and my Twitter. Like I said, that'll be down in the description as well. So, have a great day. See you later. This is Evelyn O'Malley, Lady of the Realm. Sign up.